Hey, 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 what is up, YouTube? It is your boy Chris, and I'm back at it again with another banger video. And I am here with my beautiful mother. Oh, yeah. And you already know what we are getting to. But before we continue, if you are new to this channel, please subscribe. And if you're not, please like this video and comment something down below in the comment section. And for me talking, let's get straight into it. Oh. Don't F up. So the situation now is you still have this pending case, right? Yeah. And so when do you have to go back to court? That's for down here. July 20th. That's for them to let me travel again. Okay. If she might, though. Mm hmm Hope so. I think we've been seeing so many different things in the news, you know, with artists getting caught up in different things. Like, we just looked at the Meek Mill situation, and I know you and Meek are cool, you know, and I'm sure you guys have had a conversation about your situation as well. Yeah. What does he say to you? Man, I had a talk with him while he was in jail. Mm-hmm. He was telling me, man, it's different, don't, don't, I don't know, he was just telling me, don't fuck up. And I said, like, two weeks later, I fucked up. Mm -hmm. I had fucked up. I went back to jail, but they let me out, though. They let me out after, like, I think 18 days. When you was in there, did you think they was going to let you out? Or did yeah, you feel nah. like it might not happen? <laughs> Every time I go to jail, I be prepared. Mm -hmm. I be prepared, like, damn, what is it, five years, 10 years of time? I don't want some shit, like, let's get it over with. Don't have me sitting there not knowing when I'm coming home. And it's super right. fair. I don't let's get it over with. So now, how do you feel like you really can't fuck up at all? I don't want to. It'll hurt me. Mm -hmm. Like, y'all think about it. I'm still a child. I still cry. Like, they, none, of them, none of my niggas will never see me cry. Right. But I cry. Yeah. I swear I do. You've been through a lot, though. Mm. Even from being young. Like, we see the scars on your forehead, and I know you broke your neck. When you was just a little, mm, tell me that. how old were you? Four. Four years old. Four years old. Yeah, I broke my neck in the house. He was wrestling. Mm -hmm. Oh, mm -hmm. I thought he got hit by a car. You remember like everything that happened? Cause I, you were only four, but I know that's a real traumatic experience. I remember everything. Mm -hmm. I don't forget nothing. Nothing. So talk about that, like how that happened. Yeah, he was. He I was wrestling. What you remember? I was wrestling on the bed. Uh, nigga slammed me. And when he slammed me, I fell off the bed though. And my neck, my chin was behind my shoulder. Ooh. I couldn't move it. I walked to the front room. I'm screaming for my grandma. She like, sit down on the side of the bed. I sit down on the side of the bed. She trying to pull my shit and push it back. Wow. I'm like, no, don't touch it, don't touch it. That when the ammo lounge came. I, for after it. that, I know I had went to sleep because I don't remember nothing. But when I woke up, I remember I seen my mama, my grandma, and my sister, plus Shonda. I had this thing on my head with screws. I'm like, what the hell is this? They're like, nothing. They're like, how you feel? I'm like, I'm good. They're like, stand up and see if you can walk. I stood up and I walked. They're like, all right, you good. They told me they're going to let me go home in the next five days. Basically. You tell me. Yeah, actually, this episode, which is everything that I told you that I heard. Yeah. Stuff like that. But shout out to grandma. My grandma and be too. She's here. Sit down so we can fix it. Because <laughs> we know how, hey, you know that hospital bill going to be high as hell. And the ambulance bill is $500 to transport. So mm -hmm. I get it. But yeah, I don't think we really have anything to say, bro. Mm -hmm. I just so, like how he's soft spoken. Yeah. So, yeah, that's it. That's the end of this video. I really hope y'all enjoy it. Please do not forget to leave a like, comment. If you are new, get close to it. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe. I right? we so close to 2K. We're gonna roll it to 10K. You know what I mean? I love y'all. Who you? Whoever's what you watching it right now? You watching it right? Give me some down. Come on. No, no, hold on, no, hold on, no, hold on, no, hold on. You, you get, you get your PSA out, public yeah. service now? Yeah, I, it, it was, you know, pers personal. Personal. Okay. Yeah, but yeah, that's an Hello. Put my phone in. Doctor, is that you? Oh, ah. Damn. Hi. I'm sorry. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! That if you mess up, it's your fault. <laughs> Like choice to do right, choice to do wrong. Why are you yelling? Beat death in a certain kind of way. Plenty of times. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you want to die though, so mm -hmm. you don't feel nothing no more. I don't think you really feel like that. Mm. You got to talk more. You oh. Talk more, you understand. Mm -hmm. Because she I also feel like you do have four kids. Yeah, they good though. And... You've been successful so far, but there's a lot of things you still have to overcome. 
I got a choice to do right and I got a choice to do wrong. I mean, I been staying out the way. So basically, I be wanting her to see like that I'm trying to change, like, like I don't want to be here. Like, I don't want to be in jail neither. But when I'm walking in court, like, you never know. It's either 10 years or you're going to go home or you going to go or she going to let you go back on the road. There's only three things. Mm -hmm. So I be so scared because I've been on some shit like, damn, like, all they do is bring up the negative. They don't say what mm. we do good. Well, talk about what you do good. I don't know. I do a lot. I just don't put it on camera because I don't do it for like. But let's talk about it. Say that. Because I would like to know. No. I, I just give a lot. Mm -hmm. I give a lot. That's all it is to it. I give a lot. I know the kids out here really look up to you. Do you feel a responsibility? Like, I got to, yeah. like you know, they see me. I'm out here making it. I got them hanging out. You it's showing a, everybody love. It's a street life. life. It's a street life. So they got to make their own choices. Mm -hmm. But everything, like, within this section, nah, you better not fight nobody. There's too close. Like, all this, all this is family. Shit, no violence going to surround her unless somebody come where, you know, where you have to. Like, I don't be worried with them. I be cool. I feel like ain't nobody going to pull up to her. And if they ever do and wind up doing something to me, that means it's meant. Because that's just how I feel. And I ain't going to never feel scared in my hood where I'm from. Never. You start off your album talking about how you're not a bad person at all. Hell no, nah, I ain't no gangster, ain't no gangbanger, none of that. I done made mistakes, everybody made mistakes. Mm -hmm. But true. some people just feel like they got that power for to disrespect you at any time. Yes. So then they can tell you what you want, but they really don't know how you feel. They really don't know you got a good heart. And all they know is what they see. But I don't know, I guess that's the only thing that count though, what they see. And I can respect that. I'm old enough to understand. Mm -hmm. I'm know. sure you learned a lot though since you signed your record deal up until now. You know, honestly, like you've been putting out music for about three years now, but it seems like things have moved pretty quickly for you. Yeah. I don't want to rap for long. You say three years, I feel like in six more years, I shouldn't be rapping. I should be rich as hell. Like, but I, you don't do it because you love it? I love it, but not at this point, I don't no more. Why? It didn't brought too much, it didn't brought too many problems. Like the spotlight is good for some people who want their life, but it really ain't. Because I got all these eyes watching me. I'm in the public yeah. eye. So shit, it's a lot of criticism. Like, you know, they gonna criticize me. That's why I hate it. it Bring you too many problems. Everybody want, want what you got. And everybody gonna wanna take it from you. Mm -hmm. That's true. It ain't many nights, it ain't many sweet boats, you know? I know you said when you're able to, you wanna leave Baton Rouge. Where you wanna go? Cali I wanna move to California because it's still different. I feel like I ain't gotta worry about what I gotta worry about here. Mm -hmm. I ain't gotta worry about police. You gotta worry about that everywhere, but I feel Yeah, like you definitely gotta worry about that everywhere. I feel like as much though, we ain't really gotta tell no Come on, gun. Rand, the white person walking in the background. But nobody around me gotta have no gun at all. Mm -hmm. Anything could happen, but at the same time, it's like, I don't know. I feel like it's a different life. Like I could, I could be a kid in yeah. California. That's the only place I can feel. I feel like I be a kid. My respect for young boy is when I'm even higher. Mm -hmm. uh, second of all, I like I like how he was like, I do a lot of good things, but I just don't, I don't show it on camera. What pisses me off the most is that you have all these famous people are public public figures are you know what I mean celebrity whatever you want to call them. You have them. They have to always put it on camera to show you know what they did, what they you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. Not doing it does. for approval. Yeah, and I, I like that. But I like how he does an over talker and like he's respectful. And then I just like how you get to see a softer side. When he said, I get to be a kid, y'all know me, that just touched my heart because it's like he had to grow up super fast. And it was just, I don't know. I thought it was a good vlog. I, I see him. I'm starting to like him a whole lot more anyway, a little bit more. Oh, and then also, this the last thing I want to say. Remember how he was, he was like, um, he want to quit rapping and stuff? Mm -hmm. He's, I'm guessing it's probably been about five years probably he's been rapping now. Mm -hmm. And coming up. I feel like it's coming up. And I feel like with him doing the Sincerely Contrail, mm -hmm. I think that's him being like, I'm done with rapping. Uh, and thank you, everything he said, he's, he's doing it now. He's yeah. rich. He's in LA. He got his little girl. Yeah, and he's just... You know what I mean? Yeah. Just chilling. So I, I think, I think. Oh, well, I don't know. But do you think it might be the? the I don't know. I don't think so. Thanksgiving coming to like he's so. like I'm done. I don't think so. 
I just like how soft spoken he is. And like listening to him, he sound like a little bitty kid. Well, they think. Yeah, but like looking at him, you wouldn't project him to be that way. Like, you know, you never judge a book by its color. A cover, I'm sorry. I see <laughs> my bad. But looking at that and then hearing him and like say if you go, all you know is his videos and then you sit down and do an interview and he talks like that, you're gonna be like, like what, what the, the fuck? Right. And he's so well mannered though. I just like that. Then I like he said, uh, I don't trust them police. <laughs> Dang, you said that's far back. That was you should have said that in part two. I can say what I wanna say when I wanna say it. You should have said I that in said part two. what I said. Now I said what I said. Now. Come on, man. You always doing you something always extra. Doing something we can't never have a video. We can never have a regular video. Because of you. Because of you. You're so damn extra. Then you you always, be a parent. You, 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 you be coming on our room on cloud 38. I can't. It's my house. Mm. I don't knock on no doors until you pay half the bills in here. Hello. Ain't nobody. Police no. get her. And they ain't going to do shit. Go on in the video. Y'all, I really do hope y'all enjoy. You better quit playing with me. <laughs> Go get fucked up. Y'all, right I really do hope y'all enjoyed this video. Oh, funny. Please don't forget to leave a like, comment, and comment, subscribe. Uh -uh. And subscribe. I love you. I love y'all to get out of my fucking face. I, I was telling you, bye. I love you. I was bye. telling you, I bye. love you. I was telling you, you better I tell love these you. people bye. Mama, sit down real quick. No. Mama, sit down so I can end it. Y'all. Don't touch me. Come on, man. Uh-uh. Y'all, that is the end of this video. I really do hope y'all enjoy it. Please don't forget to leave a like. A comment. And subscribe. What he said. Also, go subscribe to the couple channel and Chris. And yeah, follow me on all my social medias. And yeah. Always on Twitter. I love you. I love y'all too. Bye. Get off of me, motherfucker. Damn.